if you have missed any checkups, if you want to just come in and talk to a doctor, you can do that as well. This is the 10th year for Take a Loved One to the Doctor Day. They can get free clinical breast screenings and prostate cancer screenings, kidney risk assessments, waist circumference, so much uh, that they can do tomorrow. I don't think anyone would tur be turned around, even if you have insurance. Nobody's going to be asking for insurance information. Uh, nobody's going to ask. Uh, it's not for my noise, it's for everybody. And we hope everybody comes. Johnny Payne's helped with the event every year, but he got involved for a different reason. I thought maybe if, if HR calls you and tells you to go to a screen, and maybe you better go, or maybe you won't have a job. When Payne's work had a similar event, he felt he had to go, and it's a good thing he did. Uh, initially, when you get diagnosed, most folks don't know anything about it. I knew nothing. Payne tested positive for prostate cancer. Thirteen years later, he helps others by spreading the word, inspiring them to get checked out. And I felt like that if I didn't wasn't aware of all this, there must have been a whole lot of other folks just like me that didn't know not about it. Allie Miles, WYFF News 4 at the Croc Center. Take a loved one to the doctor happens tomorrow at the Croc Center in downtown Greenville. It starts at 9 o'clock in the morning, runs through 1 o'clock in the afternoon. It is free and will be first come, first serve. Some of the politics for you tonight.